सो वाट्स गाइस वेलकम टू माई चैनल वेलकम टू अदर वीडियो तो गाइस आज के इस वीडियो होने वाले बहुत ही खतरनाक एंड जबरदस्त क्योंकि पबजी प्लेस के लिए बहुत ही शॉकिंग न्यूज़ होने वाली है तो वीडियो शुरू करने से पहले मेरे रिक्वेस्ट है ये न्यूज़ मतलब ये वीडियो जल्द से ज़्यादा शेयर कर दो ताकि वो भी आ सके तो चैनल पर नया तो क्या करना है वह जल्दी जल्द सब्सक्राइब बटन दे दो मतलब लाल कलर का सब्सक्राइब बटन दे दो उसे दबा से बजा दो और उसके साथ बेल बेल आइकॉन भी रंग कर दे बजा दो क्योंकि ऐसे इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक रोज मैं लेकर आऊँगा लाता रहूँगा तो इधर इन्वेस्टिंग लेट्स ट्रैक द वीडियो तो गैस इतना दिन से मैं क्यों शॉकिंग खतरनाक न्यूज़ बोल रहा था शॉकिंग न्यूज़ है मतलब आप लोग बोलो पबजी का क्रिएटर कौन है मतलब आप लोगों से ज़्यादा से ज़्यादा नाइन्टी परसेंट लोग बोलोगे ब्रेंडन ग्रीन हाँ भाई ब्रेंडन ग्रीन उन्होंने क्राफ्टन छोड़ दिया क्यों छोड़ दिया इनका जवाब मैं दे ही देता हूँ क्योंकि उन्होंने एक प्रोजेक्ट बनानी मतलब एक प्रोजेक्ट बनाएगा गेम का ही प्रोजेक्ट बनाएगा इसलिए वो छोड़ दिया क्राफ्टन तो अब लोग ज़्यादा से ज़्यादा बोलो क्या है क्या है झूठ फूट बोल रहे कहाँ से एक झूठ फूट निकल के हम हम पर बता रहे शरारती बंदे बहुत नहीं भाई ये सच्ची है ब्रेंडन ग्रीन क्राफ्टन छोड़ दिया सिर्फ एक प्रोजेक्ट के लिए हमारा ब्रेंडन ग्रीन क्राफ्टन छोड़ दिया इनका प्रूफ मैं वीडियो की लास्ट में दिखा दूंगा तो गैस ये न्यूज़ सुनने के बाद आपको क्या होगा नीचे कमेंट पर बता देना तो चलिए उस वीडियो देख लो और गाइस वीडियो अच्छी लगी तो लाइक करना चैनल पर नया तो सब्सक्राइब करना चलो लेट्स बिगन वीडियो और गाइस एक मिनट एक मिनट हमारे चैनल पे 1.5 के सब्सक्राइबर हो जाने के बाद एक गिवाए होगा हाँ गाइस हंड्रेड वाइल के लिए एक गिवाए होगा तो कुछ नहीं करना मैं उस मैंने उसके लिए एक वीडियो भी बना दूँगा तो चले और गाइस ब्रेंडन ग्रीन का वीडियो देखकर ये मत सोचना गेम बैन होगा गेम फिल्म कोई बैन फैन नहीं होगा चलो लेट्स बिगिन द वीडियो हाय एवरीवन इफ यू डोंट रिकॉग्नाइज मी आई एम प्लेयर ऑन देम एंड इफ दैट स्टिल डजंट रिंग एनी बेल्स आई एम द गाय दैट क्रिएटेड द बैटल रॉयल गेम मोड अबाउट 6 इयर्स अगो नाउ एज अ मॉड फॉर आर्मा एंड देन अ फ्यू इयर्स लेटर आई वांट आउट टू हेल्प मेक अ गेम कॉल्ड प्लेयर ऑन नोन्स बैटल ग्राउंड्स और पबजी एरलियर दिस वीक I announced my departure from PUBG Studios. And today I want to speak about what's next for me and my team. But before I start, I just want to take a minute and thank all the players and developers that have elevated a simple game mode into a genre of amazing games. Your imagination and innovation are inspiring to me. Thank you all. If you weren't aware, I started out making games as a modder. And actually, that's where I fell back in love with gaming. getting lost in the open fields of Chinaris. Since then, I've held this deep fascination with sandbox style open world games and the freedoms that they give their players. But I always just wish they were a bit bigger. So, that's our mission as a studio. We want to create realistic sandbox worlds on a scale that's seldom attempted. Worlds hundreds of kilometers across with thousands of players interacting, exploring and creating. I'm humbly following in the footsteps of so many other great open world developers like Marcus, Gary, Sean, and so many others. And like them, my dream is not to create a game, but rather a world. Now, there are many problems with creating worlds at the scale that I envision. But one of the more significant is that we simply don't have a way to fill these massive spaces with content, assets, game mechanics, locations, and similar things in a reasonable amount of time. Realistic open worlds take a great deal of time and effort to produce. And so this was the first issue that we chose to tackle. The key to making things bigger than humans can create on their own has always been to get machines to pitch in and help. And and that's exactly what we've done here. Our machine is a neural network, and our network gives us a way to learn and then generate massive realistic open worlds at runtime. Or to put it another way, each and every time that you press play. It's this breakthrough that we hope will start pushing video game worlds to the sorts of scale that would lend weight to the idea of you see that mountain, you can climb it. And coming across a beautiful corner tucked away in a vast wilderness, 
I think that is real meaning when thousands of players haven't passed that way in the last hour. This is what me and my team have been working on. We're developing this technology required to enable massive scale within open world games. It's been a fascinating project to date, and soon we'll be ready to show off some of what we've achieved. Which brings me to Prologue. As I said, first, we need to build out the technology required to generate these vast worlds, the, the ground on which we'll play, so to speak. Prologue is intended to serve as a, a simple introduction to an early iteration of our technology and a chance to look at what we've accomplished by leveraging machine learning. In Prologue, you'll need to find your way across a runtime generated wilderness and use found tools and gather the resources to survive on a journey where harsh weather is your constant foe. There will be no guidance, no path for you to follow, just a world, a spot on the map to reach and the tools needed to get there. We've also decided to release Prologue as a tech demo rather than a complete game, a way for you to experience an early iteration of our terrain generation tool. Our aim with Prologue is to open the door to our studio and to show you what we're working on. And because Prologue is a tech demo, we're going to let you pay what you want for it. If you like what you see, enjoy the experience, and want to support the team, that'll be entirely up to you. This is just the start though, a small glimpse at the technology that will eventually power a much more extensive experience. Prologue is our first step on a multi-year journey towards creating what we hope will be rich and interactive open worlds. Look, I know I've been a little light on details, so to give you more insight into our plans, we've done an in-depth interview with Dean Takahashi, which will be released tomorrow over in Venture Geek. Finally, if after reading that and you think what we're working on sounds interesting, please do drop by our website and check out our career page. So that's all for me today. If you're still here, uh, thanks for listening, and I'll talk to you all again soon. Until next time, bye for now. Up.